if Obamacare is repealed, is there anything you can do to ensure the provisions are in place so that half of my paycheck won't be spent on health care? I didn't ask for cancer. Yeah. I never smoked. I never drank a lot. I've lived a pretty healthy lifestyle. I fear that I fear that if Obama, if I don't have Obamacare, if I'm not covered, then my pre-existing condition of breast cancer and remaining treatments would make it difficult for me to afford insurance. Senator Cruz, what can you do to protect people like me who are alive because of Obamacare? Well, Neil, th thank you for asking that question. And, and how, long, how long have you been diagnosed with breast cancer? I was diagnosed on April 25th, 2016. Oh, wow. Well, you, well you're, you're doing great. Th you know, our prayers are with you. I'll tell you, my mom had breast cancer. And, and my mom was diagnosed in 2000. I, I sat by her hospital bed as she went through two surgeries. And, and it's a horrible disease, but 16 years later, thank God she is a survivor. And, and I will tell you, our medical innovation has been incredible dealing with breast cancer. And so all of us, our prayers and thoughts are with you. Thank you. Uh, you know, you asked about people who get sick and not wanting your insurance canceled, not wanting your premiums to go up. That's absolutely right. That is absolutely right. And, and if you look at every proposal that's been submitted, every, every significant proposal that's been submitted to replace Obamacare, to fix the problems in the health care system after Obamacare has gotten rid of, all of them protect people in your situations. All of them prohibit insurance companies from canceling someone because they got sick. They prohibit insurance companies from jacking up the insurance rates because they got sick or injured. Look, the whole point of insurance is, is none of us know if we're going to wake up tomorrow like you did earlier, earlier last year and discover we have a terrible disease. And, and, and we buy insurance, we pay our premiums, just so we, we know that we'll be able to take care of that situation. So absolutely, we got to fix it, and I'm confident that we're going to. Senator Sanders' response? Senator, I cannot believe what you just said. <laughs> it's in direct contradiction to everything you ran for president on. What Ted has said is he wants to get rid of all federal mandates. Did you say that 100 times? I didn't say it once. I will, said Ted Cruz, <laughs> I will get... Get rid of every word of Obamacare. Excuse me. The only way that we are going to make sure that you and we all wish you the best are able to get the health insurance you need with a pre-existing condition is to make sure that no insurance company in this country can say no to you or to anybody else. Now, Ted thinks that's a terrible government intrusion. I think it is the moral and right thing to do. So when you hear uh, Ted and other Republicans say, we're going to get rid of all of Obamacare, we're going to leave it to the states. Well, what do you think the states are going to do? You think they're going to maintain the uh, ability to, to protect people with pre-existing conditions? They're not. We're going to go back to the obscenity of where we were before Obamacare was passed.